Got an equilibrium question here where you've got to calculate Kc from a sterification reaction. You might want to use this to um, test yourself on the equilibrium topic. So as always, the link to the questions in the description of the video, just click on that, have a go, and then play on for the answer. Okay, so the question's about the reaction between ethanoic acid and ethanol in the presence of an acid catalyst, which obviously produces the ester ethyl ethanoate and water. So we've got the starting masses for the ethanol and ethanoic acid, and we're told that when the mixture had reached equilibrium, that many moles of ethanoic acid was left. I'm going to use that to calculate a value for Kc and explain why there are no units for the equilibrium constant. So you can see I've started um, the first bit of the calculation. So I'm working out the initial moles of the ethanoic acid and ethanol. Mass over MR, so it's one mole of ethanoic acid has reacted with um, 0.18 moles of ethanol. Obviously, at the very start of the reaction, you won't have any products formed, so they're both at zero. And I'm going to jump straight to the information we're given. We're told at equilibrium, 0.829 moles of ethanoic acid is left. So the final moles or the equilibrium moles of ethanoic acid is 0.829. So from that, we can get everything that we need. So there's been a change in moles of ethanoic acid of 1 minus 0.829, which is, I'll just put a minus sign there because it's dropped, 0.171. Now because the mole ratio is 1 to 1, there's going to be the same amount of ethanol that will react, so that's going to go down by 0.171. Still a 1 to 1 ratio in the products, so we're going to go up from 0 to 0.171 and likewise with the water. So all we need to do now is work out the moles of um, ethanol that's going to be left. So that's going to be 0 0.18 minus 0 0.171, which is 0 0.009. And obviously these are 171. So the expression for the equilibrium constant Kc is the equilibrium concentration of the products, so ester and water, over the reactants. There's no powers to put in because everything's got a 1 in front of it in the balanced equation. Now, technically, these are the moles, but because everything's in the same volume, the mole ratio is the same as the concentration ratio. So we can just put the moles in here. So let's put the numbers in. So they're both the same, remember, 0 0.171. So I've just squared that on the top. Divided by 0 0.829 times 0 0.009. So the numerical value of Kc is 3.92. And the final thing I had to say was why there are no units. So if you think about it, the all of these concentrations are moles per decimeter cubed. They're all going to cancel because there's no powers in there. So no units as all the moles per decimeter cubed cancel in the Kc expression is what I would suggest that you would write.